this book, which we have come to call the Immigration Cookbook, we call it that because that's what it is. It is full of recipes and ingredients. There are over 400 items in this book. It covers a range of non-immigrant and immigrant categories. Each chapter includes an overview of the requirements of the category, a step-by-step -step case flow, which gives you each step that needs to be taken by the attorney, by the staff, and by the clients throughout the case from start to finish. It includes eligibility assessment charts that the attorney can use to verify eligibility that the client meets all the requirements for the benefits at the beginning of the process and to reassess throughout the process. It includes intake questionnaires for the attorney and the paralegal to provide the clients examples of support letters and guidance for support letters. Um, it includes detailed checklists for the attorney and their staff to use in preparing the application to make sure the application is complete, has the right supporting documents. It also includes examples of attorney cover letters and of other documents that the attorney will be preparing uh, for the case. It includes point-by-point -point guide on how to complete the forms, uh, which you know we all have questions. Does this mean this? Does this mean that? Well, these are addressed in those point-by-point uh, -point guides uh, for all the forms for each case. Uh, it also includes examples of completed forms. So you can see it if you haven't done these forms before, you can see what a completed form looks like. One of my favorite things that we have in the book is something that um, we do at our law firm, which is uh, we have basically uh, essentially a cheat sheet uh, that at the very end of preparing the case before it goes out the door, uh, it's a final checklist, um, usually actually that somebody who was not working on the case, uh, a second set of eyes, um, can go through and when they're looking at the application. Um, and it's really a, uh, it's really a fail safe um, to make sure that uh, simple mistakes that a lot of times people um, would, would potentially miss, like making sure that it's going to the right address or making sure the fee is precisely calculated. Um, and that's a, uh, and, and that's something that, um, I, I think a lot of firms don't do, and hopefully this will make it a little bit easier for them to implement that uh, final system check. I think this book stands out for a couple of important reasons. Um, one is just the sheer vastness of the, of the book. Ari and I worked on this for three years um, to get this first edition out, uh, and it's coming in um, at 2,500 plus pages. Um, it's one of the, uh, the largest books I think that AOLA has ever published um, and it's coming in as a two volume uh, initial edition. Um, but I think it's also helpful that the book is written by um, a single pair of authors. Um, there are multi author books out there that are good but I think it's actually helpful to have a cohesive um, narrative. Uh, throughout the book where each chapter is structured in a relatively similar way. Uh, and I think that it's going to be uh, very user-friendly in that respect. Um, I think the book is also, uh, I'm happy that the price of the book I think is, uh, is at a level that I think um, will make it very affordable uh, for most lawyers, uh, regardless of their level of practice. Um, there have been other uh, books on the market that are priced at a much higher uh, price point that have tried to address some similar issues. Um, but I think this book is, is going to be inexpensive enough for most lawyers to use. And I think it'll justify uh, the cost after just one case. So any law firm or immigration lawyer would benefit from this book. The book is great for new lawyers and for lawyers who are trying new types of cases they've never done before. Um, it's a set of tools and examples and guidance that is meant to be taken straight out of the box that covers the full case from beginning to end. Um, more seasoned practitioners and firms will also benefit from this. The tools are tools that we use every single day in our practice. It cuts down on the number of rejections and uh, from the government mailrooms. Uh, and cuts down on the number of RFEs that you'll be receiving. Uh, it also cuts down on the back and forth with clients. You get the right documents earlier in the process. Uh, it's also great for training paralegals, new staff, um, and improving current staff on the processes and significantly improves quality control in your firm.
great thing about this book is it brings you um, efficiency, it gives you organization, um, it gives you the tools to be able to handle cases that you haven't handled before. Uh, it gives you tools and guidance to improve on cases that you uh, have been handling. Even attorneys that have been handling certain cases for years will hopefully find um, differences in the way that, that it's done here that will be beneficial that they, they will include in their practice uh, moving forward. Immigration lawyers are under more pressure than ever in terms of their finances. Profitability is, is not always easy to achieve. It's a, uh, and, and, and some lawyers um, can luck into having a financially successful practice, but for most lawyers, it requires uh, a lot of work. Um, so you're already working hard enough just to keep up with the law and, 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 and be a good lawyer to your clients. Uh, and one of the things that can make you more profitable and make your practice uh, more successful and hopefully help you sleep better at night are having really good systems in place. And those systems are comprised of a lot of the items that we have in this book. Good checklists of documents, good process steps, good templates. If you have a uniform good system in place, um, it doesn't guarantee your practice is going to be successful but bad systems are almost a guarantee that your practice is going to be unsuccessful. Uh, and these days, um, you know, good work-life balance is going to depend to a lot of extent on the efficiency of your practice. And I, I hope that this book contributes to that. I think it does. Mm -hmm.